In this video, I'm going to teach you how to set up Logitech G29 on PC Hero Truck Simulator 2. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Setting up a Logitech G29 on your PC to play Hero Truck Simulator 2 is extremely simple. The game has full steering wheel support, not only for the G29, but any other steering wheel model that you connect. So all that you have to do is first connect the G29 to your PC. So plug the USB cable from the G29 base into any of the available USB ports on your PC. Go ahead and also connect the pedals and shifter to the G29 base using the provided cables. Once the connection has been established, what I recommend is that you go over to the Logitech website and you download the Logitech G-Hub software. Now, this isn't going to be mandatory, however, having the G-Hub makes it extremely simple to not only set up the steering wheel, but also check for any firmware updates that might be needed for it to run properly. But if you don't want to spend time in time downloading the G-Hub software, just try to go ahead and use it without setting up G-Hub. And if it doesn't work, then you can go ahead and download it there. So when you open Eurotrack Simulator 2 with the steering wheel connected to your PC, you will be able to go over to Options, Controls, and then choose the option Quick Setup of the Game Pad or Steering Wheel. Now just follow through the instructions on screen. You will be able to choose it here. Now, sadly, I don't have a steering wheel to demonstrate this process in full. I'm going to emulate this with a controller, but don't worry, it is easy to follow the on-screen instructions. So click this option here at the bottom, and then you will be able to choose the gearbox type. Of course, if you have one of these connected, you will also be able to select it, and they even recommend the G model of steering wheels here. So when you choose a shifter, you will be able to use it in Euro Truck Simulator 2, and you can change all of the aspects about it here. Like I said, I apologize. I do not have a compatible steering wheel to demonstrate this process in full, but you will be able to select it and use it easily. So once this is set up, just finish the wizard, go into a run, and you will be able to use this steering wheel to control it. You will be able to find it here on the input devices, and you can control it using the steering wheel. I hope I was able to help you on how to set up Logitech G29 PC Hero Truck Simulator 2. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.